hello everyone welcome to my youtube channel so this is kind of an impromptu video i did not plan to do this video at all but i i'm so encouraged guys and i thought i would share this quickly with you so yesterday evening i was at home and i was just trying to write my dissertation and you know trying to write my discussion chapter and all of that stuff and a lovely a very lovely subscriber of mine commented on one of my recent videos and she said that um she wanted me to please share with her a bible verse that i had shared before in one of my previous videos which i posted like months and months and months ago and she said that um, the the Bible verse really really encouraged her, and she she that she loves the Bible study videos that I put out, and that um, God uses them to speak to her, and that she 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 feels like it's really encouraging, and I was touched by that, not because someone loved like the work that I do or me putting out these videos that people are actually watching them and appreciating my effort, but no. I was encouraged because I know that all these videos that I put out, they are all um, inspired by my personal struggles. Um, and I remember one of the videos that I put out like in September, it was called Life is Hard But God is Good. That video was totally inspired by one of the things that I had just been through. And you would know that if you've watched that video. But to see that um, sharing my struggles and sharing with you guys how God has pulled me through these things, to see that God is using my testimony somehow to encourage you guys, it's actually amazing. It's so amazing. And then this has just, um, this has just encouraged me that, um, or just showing me how important it is to actually share your struggles to share your pain to share your sorrow with others so that they would know that they're not alone in their struggles i feel like in the world that we live in today everyone seems to um or everyone wants to present themselves to the world as perfect you know having the perfect life or perfect relationship having the perfect family you know and all of that stuff but life is hard and we know better we know that that is the truth we know that no one's life is perfect we know that we all have trials and struggles and we go through pain once in a while but it's the faithfulness and the grace of god that brings us through all of these trials and all of these struggles and the reason why we're still standing here today to be able to smile and you know and and still walk freely and have that joy is only by the grace of god now, if we don't share these testimonies, if we don't share these struggles with others, how how are we going to encourage one another? I have been so encouraged that, you know, my struggles, you know, God can use my struggles to mold a beautiful testimony that would encourage someone in a way that I would never expect. Who would have known that just sharing a Bible verse and just telling you about how God helped me not to worry about my exams, you know, who would have known that that would go a long way to encourage someone I don't even know and someone I've never even met in, you know, a different part of the world? Share your struggles, guys. Share your pain. Share your sorrows. You never know who God can encourage using your story. And to just re re reiterate, reiterate my point, I don't know how to say that word. I just want to read from Philippians chapter 1, and this is um, the Apostle Paul's story. So basically, Apostle Paul was in, he was in prison, he was in chains. And um, from, from verse 12 says, Now I want you to know, brothers and sisters, that what has happened to me has actually served to advance the gospel. As a result, it has become clear throughout the whole palace palace guard and to everyone else that i am in chains for christ and because of my chains most of the brothers and sisters have become confident in the lord and dare all the more to proclaim the gospel without fear now you can see that apostle paul was in chains he was you know a man who he was in prison but his love for the gospel was actually so admirable and just to see that um just to see that you know he was using the fact that he was in chains you know that didn't stop him from telling others about christ and telling others about how faithful god has been because he was confident 
in God's character. He was confident that God is a good God. And because, you know, other people were encouraged by his own faith in Christ, you know, that the early church, they, they came together, they prayed together, they fasted, they, they, the bonds, what brought them together was actually, you know, how they were being persecuted and how they could come together and pray for each other. It was such an amazing bond. And the most beautiful thing about, you know, sharing your struggles and encouraging each other when you're going through trials is that when you do overcome by God's grace, you know, the joy that you will feel is even even so amazing when you have people to share that joy with you. And, you know, in the end, all the glory will be given to God. You know, it, it's, it's so amazing when you share your struggles with others and you see that you're not alone and that you're all going or walking through this Christian journey together. This is one of the reasons why I started this YouTube channel is because I wanted to share what God has been teaching me. And it's so amazing. I'm so blessed to know that God is using my struggles, my testimonies, you know, my little testimonies, which, you know, might be insignificant to some people, but God is still using these things that I'm sharing to encourage others. And I cannot be more grateful. Thank you guys so much, so much for all your love, all your comments. I love you guys so much. Literally, I am so blessed. I am so encouraged every single time when you guys leave comments and you talk about how these things encourage you. I thank God all the more because God is the one who has given me these things to be able to share with you guys. And it just reminds me of God's faithfulness and God's mercies. And and um, I just wanted to say that I love you guys so much. And um, yeah, I hope that um, God you know, that he sees our hearts and he sees our heart desires, that he continues to bring you through um, everything that you're going through and that in the end, we will all give him glory. So yeah, share your struggles today, guys. Share your pain, share your sorrows. You never know who you might encourage. Thank you so much for watching. I'm about to leave for uni now. Um, I'm going to stay in uni until I finish the work that I'm supposed to be doing. But I just thought I'll share this quickly with you guys. Thank you so much for watching. Have a lovely weekend and God bless. Bye. I will worship him forever, love him forever.